The GEF is designed from first principles to be complementary to NATO's deterrence and defence posture. Never has the GEF been more important and relevant than it is today. During the course of our meeting, the Russian Federation has recognised Ukraine's Donetsk and Lushank regions as independent states, breaching Minsk agreements and international law. All ten defence ministers are united in our condemnation of that unjustified act, the build-up of Russian forces on the border of Ukraine and further incursion in the Donbass region. We strongly support the sovereignty and territorial integrity of Ukraine and reiterate the right of all sovereign nations to choose their own path, their own security arrangements and their own alliances, free from external aggression and coercion, as a fundamental principle of the European security order. We call on Russia to de-escalate and encourage them to, encourage, to engage in transparent dialogue, including through OSCE and the NATO-Russia Council, in order to reduce tensions. We also condemn the instrumentalisation of migration flows and other hybrid activity towards Latvia, Lithuania and Poland by the Belarusian regime. We have reviewed the progress we have made in the development of the GEF as an agile, capable and ready force and today agreed to undertake a series of integrated military activities across our part of Northern Europe, at sea, on land and in the air. For example, we will shortly conduct an exercise demonstrating Jeff Nation's freedom of movement in the Baltic Sea. These and subsequent activities will remain preventative and proportionate. In acting together, we shall demonstrate the Jeff's solidarity, capability and resolve to stand together for security and stability of our region. Thank you very much.